Hello and welcome to 60 Second News. I'm Beverly Davis-Jones. Council services are now running as normal following the recent adverse weather, but every effort is being made to ensure everyone is prepared for any further cold snaps. Tameside's grit stockpile is being replenished and schools are being encouraged to store their own salt supply. Bin collections are back on schedule thanks to the joint efforts of refuse workers and local people. Workers collected 40% more waste than normal last week to clear the backlog, whilst households have contributed to the effort by recycling. Tameside's newest art gallery, the Rutherford in Hyde, has been given the stamp of quality from the National Museums, Libraries and Archives Council, and a new exhibition tracing the long and affectionate relationships of the Manchester Regiment with other units from across the world has started at the Museum of the Manchester Regiment at Ashton Town Hall. Science lessons are taking off in Tameside schools. Now pupils are being offered the chance to name a new eco-friendly rocket. High based Star Chaser Industries has joined forces with the Council to create the Tameside Rocket Science Challenge, which involves a number of interactive workshops and activities. And finally, Tameside Mayor Councillor John Sullivan has something special on the menu for lunch over the coming months. He'll be hosting a series of lunchtime music concerts at Ashton Town Hall in aid of his charity appeal fund. For further details, see www.tameside.gov.uk forward slash mayor forward slash events. That's all for now. See you next week.